So I decided to do a quick outline of a lion for my project and I just did this in pencil, a really quick sketch. And I erased it a little bit so it wouldn't show through when I painted over it. And right here I'm mixing a blue color to put in the dark pieces of this painting. So that's what I'm doing right now. I'm just putting the darks where I can see them in my reference photo and kind of blending out where I want um, there to be sort of the impression of fur. So I'm just going around and putting in all of my darks to start. Now I'm adding in a little bit of a darker brown in over the places where I put the blue just to add a little bit more definition and some finer detail. So as you can see, I'm adding the brown in and I'm putting a little bit of white in where maybe I put a little bit too much dark in the beginning. And then I was just showing you guys the yellow that I was using. It's sort of a mustard yellow that I was gonna use for the base color for my lion. And I'm just quickly putting that um, over some of the dark parts and on the whites of the face to start adding some color into my painting and um, a little bit later I'll start to put in a lighter yellow just to add some more dimension and to make it brighter because it's sort of um, dark and muted right now. I'm just going over some of the original yellow that I put in before just to kind of blend everything together and make it a little bit brighter. So that's what I'm doing right now and I'm kind of trying to give um, some of those wispier brush strokes just so it kind of looks more like hair. And for the rest of this painting I just continue to put uh, this yellow in and then towards the end I go back in and I put some brown just to kind of give it more of a, of a natural color because it's very blue right now. Um, and I wanted to just add back in some definition with the brown. So um, at the end, you'll see a picture in the slideshow of the finished product and with the brown in there. So this is my final painting. And then you can see here the brown that I added in and kind of just took my paintbrush and patted it to give it that kind of like messy uh, brush stroke look to it like I said before to give it more of like a hair or fur kind of feel. So this is uh, my final and then after this I am going to take a photograph of it and print it and then move on to the collage portion of this project.